Is Kim Kardashian living in a haunted house? Well, that's what we're going to try and find out today in this episode of the Paranormal Roundup. This, of course, is the series where we give you guys the rundown on everything that's going on in the paranormal community at the minute. And uh, this one's a weird one with Kim Kardashian and, and many other celebrities having paranormal encounters that I discovered whilst researching this topic. Now, Lainey hit me up yesterday, sent me a message and said, Ben, Kim Kardashian's just posted this to her Instagram. It's weird. You might want to check it out for a paranormal roundup. And I thought, oh, OK, girl, I'll check this out. Now, hitting up Kim Kardashian on her Instagram page, she's posted this photo 18 hours ago, okay? And it's a photo on the surface that looks pretty standard for a Kim K post, but when you look into the caption, it says, so I took this pic late last uh, week when I was alone and now I'm going through my phone and I'm freaking out noticing a woman in the window, which of course led everyone to look at this little purple circle which I thought was highlighting something to begin with, but it turns out it's just one of those smart mirrors. So that's just a button before anyone like thinks that that's kind of highlighting something. It's not, that's one of those buttons that you tap on like, you know where the, the uh, lights come on here for like that glamour effect. But this is where Kim K is getting freaked out at because this is that supposed woman that she can see within the photo. Um, it's weird, it really is weird, especially if she's claiming to be home alone whether she is home alone or not, I don't know, but um, it's an incredibly weird one. And I thought, hmm, I wonder if Kim K's ever had any other paranormal encounters, which then led me down about a three hour rabbit hole yesterday as I was researching this case, this topic, and turns out this isn't the first encounter that Kim Kardashian has had with some spooky stuff within her house. And there's actually someone that's probably arguably even more famous than she is that's supposedly haunting her house. Supposedly being the optical word there. Please do not take my word as gospel there. So, obviously scrolling through the comments here first before I get into the other stuff. Everyone's just talking about one of the nannies or the maids. Marilyn Monroe, mad at you sis. Um, people talking about it being photoshopped. Now this isn't, this wouldn't be um, uncommon for one of the Kardashians to have uh, this, you know, made up for headlines. It's, kind of their thing to stay relevant um so you know we're gonna take this one with a pinch of salt but it gets weirder as we scroll through some other things that she's had happen so i did a bit of research and a bit of googling one thing that came up was this ok magazine article where it highlights celebrities who have had ghost encounters uh, from holly willoughby to kim kardashian to even ariana grande um these stars creepy ghost stories will leave you speechless so scrolling down I'm gonna have a look at the Kim K one because that's obviously the highlight in the topic, but you know, Holly Willoughby's got a weird one, which she has. Um, I'll link all of these articles down below so you can go and read the full stories for yourself uh, if you're interested in any of these other celebrities that are having these weird encounters. But my top one is the Kim K one. Where, whereabouts is it? Um, right, so that's Holly Willoughby's. Right, the number three I did. No, that's, right, Kim Kardashian. Kris Jenner believes her late ex-husband, Robert Kardashian, tried to warn Kim Kardashian the day she was attacked in Paris. Let's have a little scroll through this. During an episode of Keeping Up With The Kardashians, Kris explained how Kim was uh, has had a Blackberry for years now, and yet she never set an alarm on it. However, the day of the Paris attack, uh, which was also the anniversary of Robert's funeral, an alarm went off on Kim's phone. Kris said, it's crazy because we all believe uh, that when we lose somebody really close to us, that they still have a way of communicating with you. E uh, you really pay attention. She also added, so maybe this was him warning Kim. Interesting stuff, right? Now, obviously there's not, that's quite a gray article, quite a great interview. Whether that's, um, you know, paranormal or just a coincidence, I don't know, I'll leave that for you guys to decide, but, it doesn't end there, peeps. Oh no, it does not. As on The Sun, they've also posted something, and this is spanned back, all the way back, not just like the past like few years. This one goes back to 2012. This is an encounter from 2012. Highlight being, Kim's horror, Kardashian fans terrified as they spot a ghost in the background of Kim's photo. Okay, so, you know, reeling us in, The Sun. The Sun is reeling us in, and it says, that uh, fans of the have found a terrifying detail in a throwback photo from Kim Kardashian's Instagram page. 
The Keeping Up With Kardashian star follow, followers have made a habit of resurfacing old photos from her past. And this one is her, and I think it's an Audi R8, like wrapped in chrome, something like that. But you can tell it's an old picture just by like, you know, that's an old Kim face. Um, uh, right, here we go. Now fans have shared their shock after uncovering a photo of Kim uh, from her early days of fame. In one picture, the reality star posed in a silver sports car parked in the driveway of her mum, Chris's former home. The TV personality threw up a peace sign uh, to the camera while I was making a signature Doug face, uh, but the fans were more distracted by the background of the image, which revealed a cluttered garage of cars and toys. One noticed that uh, what looked creepy was the little girl standing on the right hand side uh, and they claimed uh, the figure might be a ghost. Picture 14 is scary, uh, is it me or does it look like there's a little girl standing in the back by the trash can on the right side, one wrote with a scared emoji. Oh my god, that fucking scared me, a second agreed. Um, but one fan remembered an image from the previous episode explaining lol it's from Christmas uh, or an event where Chris had Courtney's child pic blown up so it could be that but if we have a little look at the pic on the right hand side it's just here this little thing right here now that's terrifying I'm not gonna lie and I can completely understand because you can see white gown definitely a leg head and then some grudge hair and then you've just got Kim just like, you know, peace out in a sports car as you do flexing that wealth. Um, yeah, weird one, because I think this photo was all the way back from 2012, as they said in the article, early days of Kim's um, fame. So, you know, at that time she was kind of hitting her peak. So necessarily, would this have been a publicity stunt? I'm less inclined to think so on this one, um, just because there would have wouldn't have been a need for her to pull publicity stunts to try and uh, gain relevance. Um, but I leave it over to you guys. Do you think that this is just from an episode where uh, they're blowing up the, the 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 young face? But I don't know. I just feel like this is a bit. There's a bit more to this one. This one carries a bit more weight, in my opinion. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. But as I said earlier, um, there's speculation, rumouring. Or surrounding this whole Kim Kardashian being haunted thing um, with someone who is actually far more famous than Kim like for the history books who this could, who could actually be haunting Kim Kardashian and her family in the haunted house so as we move over to Twitter this is where the rabbit hole kind of like led me to someone posted on Twitter saying the moment that Kim K gets herself haunted by Marilyn Monroe's ghost for the rest of her life. Now if we go back to the old Instagram post, the initial one right here, someone actually does point out that Marilyn Monroe mad at you sis. And that's the point I was kind of alluding to because this must be either a running thing um, or it's just common knowledge that Marilyn Monroe had been haunting this last. But let's check out this video from Ripley's Believe It or Not. During Kim Kardashian's Met Gala dress fitting at Ripley's Believe It or Not HQ, our team surprised her with a silver box that contained an actual lock of Marilyn's iconic platinum hair. And this has led people to speculate that there's some form of attachment to Kim K through this lock of hair. Speculative, I know. But let's check out the video. This is either really cool or a little strange, but that's who you're doing business with, right? So, what is this? It's Marilyn's hair. So, so. can clone her. So. <laughs> oh my god, I'm literally going to do some crazy voodoo shit that I want to do my And I channel her. This is so special to me. You. Thank you so much. This is so cool. So cool. Good vibes. Wow. This is sleeping with me every night. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so, Kim K getting a lock of Marilyn Monroe's hair. People then believe in that there is. But what's weird is that um, obviously all the haunted stuff, kind of, especially that one from 2012, kind of predates this because this is 2022. So all that stuff kind of predates all of this. But 
could this one potentially be linked? Because this is May of 2022, so last year. This photo obviously came out yesterday at the time of recording. Could this be linked? Do that be Marilyn Monroe? I, I don't know where to go with that. What do you guys think on this? Interesting take. Um, one that I did not expect to find myself diving into for about three hours yesterday, researching. But once I caught onto this, I thought, is there any more leverage to this? And turns out there is. There's a lot that goes on in Kim K's life. Turns out she might actually be haunted. What do you guys think? Are there any more stories of Kim Kardashian being haunted? Let me know down in the comments below. Um, I'd love to hear your thoughts and opinions on this one. And if you did go on to enjoy, be sure to jump together the hell out of that like button. Subscribe if you're new and tickle my little bell so you get notified whenever something goes on in the paranormal world. And until next time, guys, I hope that you have enjoyed and I will spook. See you later. Peace.